Today, I'm gonna find out how I would match up against Larry Bird, Magic Johnson, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, my 6'10 giraffe self. Could I win an NBA championship? We're gonna find out. But first, we must find out what team I am gonna go on this journey with. Let's get that spin wheel. You guys liked my last video. Now, I saw the comments. You guys want me to do this with the entire two hype. I will get everybody's ratings. I'm actually filming those tests right now. It's just taking a little bit long. I'm gonna try to have it done by April. I don't know. It may take some time. Let's get to this first spin. Let's let's knock out these teams, all right? <laughs> this video is brought to you by my good friends, Underdog Fantasy easiest place to play fantasy sports. With Underdog's Pick'em Game, you just predict whether players will go higher or lower on their stats, and if you get all your picks right, you could win big. They also have Scorchers, which spice up your total payout for things like Christian McCaffrey to have a receiving touchdown, or Patrick Mahomes to run it in for six. Personally, I think Mahomes is gonna run it in, so I'm gonna try to go for this Scorcher. I'm gonna do one more with Christian McCaffrey. I think he's gonna have multiple touchdowns. Receiving or rushing, doesn't matter. And that is a 9X. Usually that would be a 3X. All right, so I'm gonna do a $20. And there you go. That is my Super Bowl Scorcher Pick'em Entry. Plus, Underdog is airdropping $1 million in giveaways on Super Bowl Sunday into Underdog accounts. So make sure you get your account verified before then and check your balance throughout the day on Sunday to see if you won. Be sure to use code LSK when you sign up as new customers get their first deposit doubled up by Underdog up to $100 and you'll see a special pick for Patrick Mahomes in the Pick'em Lobby. He only needs to get one yard for that pick to be correct. Thank you Underdog Fantasy for sponsoring this video. Now let's get back to it. Ideally, if we get the Lakers, I mean, I think that's an auto chip. No Orlando, that's fine. Is every NBA team in, in this era? I don't, I don't know, 1983? I don't think the Memphis Grizzlies are a team. Here we go. The Bucks, gone. Spend, 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 come on. Warriors, gone. Eliminate Portland, gone. All right, Lakers are still there. As long as the Lakers are there, we're chilling. We're chilling. Heat gone. Philly, damn, that would have been nice. I mean, dude, guys, I'm a 77 overall, I think. I forgot. No, the Bulls. Fuck, I want to go with MJ. No. So no MJ. All right, that's fine. Come on, come on. Indiana, gone. All right, Boston is still available. So Boston and the Lakers, I mean, dude, if it comes down to that, this I should have shut up. Well, no, no Magic Johnson. We're going to have some, some struggles getting to... Back to back, dude? Bro, calm. Dude, who's even left? I don't even know if these teams are in the 80s, bro. Yo, if the Clippers are still there, do I, can I can I still be LA? Like, and the Hawks are gone, man. Hey, I'll be a bad boy. Can I be a bad boy? Bad boy Pistons? I wouldn't, I'm, I'm not mad at that. Oh man, this is, this is not looking good. And the bad boys are gone, okay. All right, what the hell, man? And Charlotte is gone. Dude, is there... I, I don't think there's any good teams left. I think I'm literally... And the Knicks are gone. I, I generally don't think the teams that are left have a franchise. Like, luca has gone. Cleveland? Dude, this is just pitiful. All right, Clippers. And they're gone too. Fuck. It's either the Jazz or the Raptors? Oh, brother. All right, I am the Jazz. You guys know. Final two. It's whatever it lands on. So I'm the Utah Jazz. Yikes. All right, we're going back in time. 1983, the era of the bird and magic. Who the fuck is on the jazz? Oh, I got Dantley. Okay, that's not bad. Hey, look, 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 we not bad. We not bad, we got Eaton, okay. All right, we, I'm not mad at it actually. I am really not mad at it. So I gotta go sign myself, all right? So we gotta, first move is signing myself. Christopher London, come on over. Oh, 120K? Yikes. You better agree, Mr. London. Oh yeah, I'll take that 120K. Sheesh, times are tough, huh? All right, guys. Um, So let's go into the coaching game plan. Um, I mean, with me being a 78, I should, I should be a nice six man. Um, I went up in overall, 78. So this is what our lineup's looking like. Ricky Green, Daryl Griffith, Adrian Dantley, T. Bailey, 
Should we try to make a trade? I, I feel like we should try to make a trade. It's not an LSK video if we don't, you know, try to make a trade real quick. You know what? Let's just see our record going, you know, going into December before we make any trades, actually. All right. All right. We are on a crazy losing streak. So I'm not liking this. I'm not liking this at all. We're seventh in the conference. We make playoffs 500. Let's look at the stats. Dude, I'm not doing too bad. I'm not doing too bad at all. All right, that's not bad. Oh, Bill Cartwright. I know him. Daryl Dawkins and Albert King. What? Ladies and gentlemen, we might have found ourselves a deal. Hold on now. Yeah, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I did it. So now, so now I'm starting. We got Daryl Dawkins, Albert King coming off the bench. Hey, we might have upgraded, fellas. I might have just did something. I think I'm going to try to get... One more star player. I, l I like just having stars on my team, you know, that we're familiar with. So I think I can do that with a little Kelly and Eves duo. Kyle Ma Oh my God. Look at it. Look at it. Kyle Massey. That's who we wanted. I'm telling you, he belongs in Utah. I'm going for it, guys. This guy belongs in Utah. Yes. Come to Utah, Kyle. All right, guys. I like our squad now. So if you want to see our new lineup, here it is. Got Ricky Green, Daryl Griffith, Adrian Dantley, Christopher London, Daryl Dawkins, Albert King, and Kyle Massey. Oh my god. And I mean Cassius Harris, but who gives a fuck about Cassius? This is gonna be this is gonna be great. Look at we're starting at 10 and 10. I want to go above 500. That's the goal here. That's the goal. Let's get to the playoff. We're we're disabling all trade offers. All right, now we're on a win streak. Okay, we lost. The, okay, that's fine. Hey, we can lose to the Rockets. They got Akeem the Dream, I think. Dude, we're above 500, fellas. We're beating, the, we're beating up on teams. Got shit on by the LA teams, though. But we beat the Knicks. Fuck the Knicks. We lose by 10 to the Bucks. Oh, we beat MJ. I want to beat Boston. Damn, we're losing by... Boston, fuck! We're so close. We're so close. We're approaching playoffs. Fifth seed finishing up the season can we finish it with a dub fourth seed lose to the lakers come on yes oh my goodness guys we finished the season second we went from what seventh to the second seed in the western conference come on bro. ralph sampson rookie of the year i mean the celtics are just dominating my god coach of the year is that mike wang executive of the year got robbed Larry Bird is just sheesh. All right. Well, third team, Ricky. Ricky. I knew I should have kept Ricky. Chris London. All team D. Yo. First team all defense. First team all defense. What you know about that? Come on, man. All right. This is where it, this is where it happens. All right, guys. So let's just look at the standings. NBA standings. So we're right behind the Lakers. Wow. What the fuck? This doesn't even make sense. Am I reading this correctly? How the hell? Is this a glitch? I mean, is it like division based here? Like what what's 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 the, how did I get the second seed? I think David Stern just wanted to see uh Utah and LA at the conference finals. Fuck it, whatever. We'll make adjustments. We're playing Golden State in the first round. Here we go. We take game one. Let's just go see the box score. I'm curious. So we beat them. Like they stole some. Look at me. Almost with the triple double, bro. I'm hacking out there, but like, bro, I'm getting I'm getting it done. We're looking for the sweep. Damn, we only won by three that game. Oh, they take one. Oh wow, this is a best of oh shit. This is a best of three. I forgot we're in the 80s, boys. Oh. And I just realized I have the beta king. I don't have the alpha king, Bernard King. <laughs> Why did I? I'm thinking I got I just realized that I saw Bernard King have 40. Alright, come on please yes all right we make it through so we're going against portland who they got man who's been going crazy i mean i'd have to assume jim paxson oh yeah we got to put him in a box we got to put him in a box one second i got something for you mr paxson all right simulate round all right here we go here we go we take game one we take game one by one point wow wow by one point and i fouled out I didn't do a goddamn thing that game. I just got fouls. Look at that. I shot one time. They had a lot of free throws. Sheesh. 
Paxton still dropped 25. All right, game two, I can't foul. If I don't foul out, I feel like we, we play better there. Oh, wow. All right, we lose that by 14. Paxton still doing, all right. So it's 1-1, one, one. wow, this is, this is kind of nerve wracking. Come on. Fuck! We got fucking shit on. What's going on, guys? Dude, I'm terrible. I'm one for six. This can't be happening. Why am I playing 39 minutes? Oh, King fouled out. All right. Dude, I'm I'm just gonna go to my normal normal coaching. I'm just gonna go to my normal. I need more basketball. I need to play less. Need more. All right. I need to limit perimeter shots. Run a pick and roll. We got it. We we had to switch it up, dude. Come on. Come on, this is it, fellas. Wait, I'm not eliminated. I'm an idiot, it's a best of five, maybe. I don't know. Come on. Don't call it a comeback. Don't call it a comeback. All right, yeah, can't do it. Dude, all right, well, we lost. Dude, we lost by two. Oh my God, and I actually had a good game. Should have ran the pick and roll earlier, bro. Uh, all right, well, guys, I mean, I went, I went pretty far with the Jazz. Um, what era should I play next? That was the Larry Bird and Magic Johnson era. I'm just curious who's going to win this whole thing. And it's the Boston Celtics and Larry Bird. Okay. Well, hope you guys enjoyed that. Give this a thumbs up. Thank you all for watching. And comment down below any suggestions for the next one. I'm having a lot of fun doing this. Until next time, go watch my last video. Peace.